Hello and welcome to STEM with Mr N, where I perform different demonstrations and explain the science behind what we're seeing. This week's episode requires a bit of engineering, as I show you an ancient device that's still in use today, the Archimedes screw. Let's check it out. The Archimedes screw was invented in ancient Greece by the scientist Archimedes, who originally designed it to be able to move water out of the hull of a ship to stop it from sinking. Later on it was used to move water from lower ground to higher ground for purposes such as irrigation, so to help farmers water their fields, and it is still in use today in wastewater plants because they are very difficult to clog. I'm going to show you how you can make your own Archimedes screw using a few simple items. For this you will need a PVC pipe, some plastic tubing, some strong tape, a couple of tubs that you can transfer water between and something to raise one of these tubs up into the air and I'm also going to use some food colouring so you can clearly see the water as it works its way through my Archimedes screw. The first thing I'm going to do is tape one end of the plastic tubing to one end of the PVC pipe making sure that the plastic tubing is still open. I'm then going to wrap the plastic tubing around the PVC pipe, trying to keep it evenly spaced as I wrap it round. I'm going to use a pair of scissors to cut off the excess plastic tubing at the end. I'm now going to tape the plastic tubing at the other end of the PVC pipe, again making sure the tubing is still open. I'm now going to fill one of my tubs with water and put in some blue food colouring. So that is my Archimedes screw, now made and ready for testing. You might want somebody to help you put together your Archimedes screw because it was quite tricky having to hold the plastic tubing while also getting a bit of tape to stick it down. Now what I'm going to do is try and move the water from my lower down tub up into this tub. Now although the level at the bottom of this tub is the same as that one, the water does need to go higher up to get over the top of it. So this is going to show how the Archimedes screw can be used to lift water from a lower down area to a higher up area. It's then going to run down into the bottom of my second tub. To start with, I'm going to put one end of the Archimedes screw into the water, making sure the open part of the plastic tubing is under the water. I'm then going to start turning the screw in the direction that would mean the plastic tubing is scooping up the water and watch my Archimedes screw in action. And there you go, my Archimedes screw has been able to move the water uphill, which is counter to what we normally think because we always think of water running downhill. So how does the Archimedes screw actually work? Well, when the plastic tubing was wrapped around the PVC pipe, there are dips there where either side of the plastic tubing is an uphill for the water. So the water as it gets scooped up falls into one of these dips, but then there's nowhere for it to go at that point with the two uphills on either side. When the screw gets turned again, the water then runs downhill into the next dip, which is actually further up the Archimedes screw. By continuing this process on, the water gradually moves through these dips until it reaches the top of the pipe and flows out into my second tub. Now, turning this by hand is not the most efficient way to get water from downhill to uphill. However, the Archimedes screw, as I mentioned earlier, is very difficult to clog and all of the Archimedes screws that are in use today are mechanical, so they move much faster and move the water much faster than I'm able to turning this one by hand. But this is a great way for you to see how an ancient device was designed, how it works and learn about how it is still used today. Well, that's all for this week. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like and subscribe buttons to stay up to date on all future content. As always, I would like to take this opportunity to answer any science questions you have about any science topics at all. So feel free to email me at stemwithmrn at outlook.com and I'll get back to you with answers to your questions. You can subscribe to the channel by pushing the button here and I've added links here 
to the other STEM demo and explanation videos I've done, here to my STEM career interviews, and here to my Things You Should Know series. This has been STEM with Mr N, exploring the Archimedes screw.